This is a really common question. Can concrete cure underwater? <laughs> well, I mean, I think the big limitation on curing concrete underwater is not all concrete can be underwater. Like it, Put your driveway underwater. I mean, you can water it. Is that the same thing? It's not the same question, but the answer is the same. In both instances, it's actually really good for the concrete. In theory, concrete that is cured underwater not only is okay, this is optimal. This is how you would achieve the optimum hydration and temperature control for the exothermic reactions of concrete that is curing. So when you put it underwater, what happens is, is you're preventing the concrete from drying out prematurely. The concrete needs to time in order to achieve strength, and you give it time by providing it with adequate, adequate moisture or hydration. If you were to put concrete underwater, not only do you provide it with some, but you provide it with all the hydration it could possibly need, and you provide it with a very stable environment in terms of temperature. So that's the idea with can you cure concrete underwater? Absolutely you can, although it doesn't work for every application. So in those applications, you can take something like a spray bottle of water and spray it down, or if it's something larger than that, you could use a sprinkler and a, your garden hose and keep it wet, like if you had a new sidewalk port or something like that. You would typically want to do this beginning when the concrete is hard, no longer soft to the touch and not going to experience any erosion from the water being on it. You don't want to damage the fresh concrete. You have to let it set up first. Once it's set up, begin watering it down multiple times a day, up to and including continuously. The first three days is the most important, followed by a week. If you're doing a week of hydration for newly poured concrete, you're doing really well.